Hey YouTube, this is Andrea here. Howdy, this is the other Andrea. Whoop, whoop. Whoop. We are here, y'all. Here, here, here. And we're here to stay. Yeah. We're working on May 8th through the 14th. In our big happy planner. Yes. And I am using special stickers today. And they are by Victoria Thatcher. And they are called Cozy Sweets 1 and Cozy Sweets 2. These are free printables that you can get. Um, and you print yourself onto sticker paper. Um, or regular paper if you have a Xyron and just run it through your Xyron. Yep. Um, and uh, coming soon is Drea's printable salon on um, Etsy and she will be doing a video about her printable salon uh, on June 4th what is it was it <laughs> May June, June 4th so I look forward to that all right you see how she's just laughing at me <laughs> it's all like a because <laughs> <laughs> I'm nervous <laughs> it's a new venture it's a new venture I'm going printable y'all She's going printable, y'all. I don't know, in my old age, I do a lot of grumbling and <laughs> noises that... And drooling. Yeah, drooling. <laughs> yeah, I almost made Drea throw up because I was drooling. Oh my god, it was so gross. I had to catch it. It was so gross. It was so gross, Drea says. <laughs> I was all like, catch it for me. And I'm like, I'm going to throw up. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. I'm not going to say stuff that might happen to me. So, <laughs> oh. yeah. Never make fun of people who drool, y'all. Because it might happen to you. And then what are you going to do? Make fun of yourself. Yep. That's all you can do. Just smile. And drool. And drool. Thank you, Dewey. Dewey just drooled on my leg. Oh, see? Hey. Runs in the family. It does. This one says, life is short, look the cake bowl. Aw, we don't even have cake bowls anymore. We don't have cake anymore. Uh -uh. My birthday will consist of some kind of, like, weird organic crap. I think we could do, on your birthday, we could do, um, cheesecake. I think that's what we did for Grandma's birthday after her surgery. Yeah, but I can only have a quarter of a, like a slice. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah. I don't get the biggest slice anymore. That's not fair. I know. You used to be like, it's my birthday. I get the biggest piece. And you guys were the same. You guys were the same. You guys always got the biggest piece on your birthdays too. It's really? tradition. Yes. I didn't know. Yes, you did. I didn't know you were watching so closely. Oh, I always did. Well. Yeah. You're all like, I get the biggest piece, it's my birthday. Oh. oh, yeah? That's what you were? Really? Yeah, I remember. What's my favorite cake? Carrot. Yes. What's my favorite cake? Chocolate. Nope. What? Strawberry. Strawberry? I love strawberry. When did you like... I've had strawberry a couple of years in a row. No, you haven't. Yes, I have. My 28th birthday was a strawberry cake. That, that might have been your 28th, but you haven't had it since or before then. I've had strawberry for my birthday before. You had chocolate. No. I don't like chocolate enough. I like chocolate icing over strawberry cake. That is delicious. <laughs> oh, I wish... She Damn it. <laughs> we, Dang it. we better stop talking about this stuff. Oh, oh when did you put the cup down? Just now. While you were talking and banging on your knee. I was banging on my leg. Your knee leg. I can't get this. Okay, finally. Good grief. I could not get that off. Victoria Thatcher does really great work, guys. Um, it's user error if you see me struggling. Yeah. <laughs> it has nothing to do with her sticker making skills. Because I can't cut a straight line no matter what. 
that says soup and Monday is a great soup day like if you wanted to plan your meals based on different um, uh, foods food groups and foods Monday makes a great soup day and Tuesdays are tacos yeah and Tuesdays always make a great taco day and Wednesdays pork chops Oh, I miss pork chops. Yeah, pretty Can soon. Can we stop talking about food? Yeah. We were supposed to stop talking about food. Yeah. Dre likes the way I make pork chops. I, really? <laughs> I just said we were stopped talking about food. Yes. So that says note, note, note. And I only have one note left, so I'm going to have to go with this one here and then note but yeah I'm excited about turning into principles yeah turning to starting and, to make principles and the stickers are gonna be so much cheaper guys yeah I mean you're just gonna be like really happy to not have to pay eight or nine bucks or 70 80 bucks when you can pay 30 40 bucks to get the same sets yeah because I will be turning the current ones into printables because yeah. my current shop will be turning into the printable salon as mom calls it yeah it's the printable salon that's what it is yeah by bows and brains yeah it's still going to be called bows and brains though yeah, I, will, I think so. that's a good idea. <laughs> <For her. coughs> so, have we had anything exciting happen this week? I don't think we have. No. Mm -hmm. Other than what we just said. No. Yeah. Yeah, that was exciting enough, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, we don't we didn't have a lot going on. No um oh there was okay. Oh there was a shooting at the park. That we live next to. Yeah. And the shooting was inside of a car on the park parking lot. The police showed up. The police asked everybody if they were okay asked them what happened the three kids said it was an accident we didn't mean to shoot him that's right a person did get shot and but it was an accident and they didn't mean to shoot and then uh the cops said okay thank you for your time have a nice life i was like what the what if that had been me, <laughs> you'd be in prison. Sitting on the parking lot. And I shot somebody in the back. You'd be in prison. In the car. And there'd be no way uh, they'd let me go. No. Me neither. Uh, heck no. They'd be like, um, you going to jail? And you going to jail? And you gonna stay there forever, and you're gonna get 50 years, which is like forever for you. Yes. Cause. Why would I only get 50 years? I I was getting 50 years. You were oh, going forever. That's messed up. <laughs> whatever. Yeah, I'll be dead in 50 years. I know. That's why they're gonna give me 50 years. No, I was flabbergasted. I cannot believe that they did that. That these kids, okay, first of all, it was two boys and a girl sitting in a car in the parking lot in at the park. Sounds like like a horror a, movie. A, yeah, a horror movie. One kid, one boy who's in the back seat, another boy who's in the driver's seat, and the girl is in the passenger seat. All right, you, you we got that picture. Yes. The boy in the back seat behind the driver finds the gun on the floor, picks it up, and shoots the guy in the back. 
The girl gets out the car and runs. Mm -hmm. The other two stay in the car because A, the first one is shot, he can't run. <laughs> and then B, the other one is so scared, he calls 911 and he says, I accidentally shot my friend in the back. Can you come help us? And then <clears throat> the girl comes back. After the police get there and question the boys, the girl comes back and she says, I ran because I was scared. <laughs> and they were like, okay. Wow. Now, get this. The boy in the back seat was 19. The boy up front was 20. And the girl, guess how old she was. Just guess. 17. 25. Okay, I already guessed. 16. Oh, I was close. 16 years old, hanging out with two 20-year-old boys at the park at 2 a.m. with a gun in the back and somebody gets shot. Yeah. I'm sorry, all of their asses are going to jail if yeah. I had been the cop on the scene. That was ridiculous. Yeah. And what the hell was that little girl doing in a car full of boys and a gun? Yeah. That's ridiculous. Yeah, it is. Oh, this is my book ones. I'll put my book ones over here. She was 16 years old. Where was her parents? Why wasn't she at home where she needed to be? And this all happened on a Thursday. Wow. Yeah. So it's not like they didn't have school the next day. Yeah. Of course, she that one kid, he, both of those two, the two boys, probably were already graduating. Yeah. Or out of school period. Yeah. Dropouts. Yeah. They were beauty school dropouts. Beauty school dropouts. That's all I know. I used to know the song. Unbelievable, right? Yeah. Unbelievable. So, I thought you guys should know if you have a park and somebody decides to shoot somebody else, um, just say, I'm sorry, <laughs> and um, run away, <laughs> then come back when the police call you on your cell phone, and then uh, say, I'm sorry when you get back, and then uh, I'll sit there and, and wait for the police to let you go <laughs> home, and then go home and uh, enjoy the rest of your life. <laughs> Just make sure whoever you shoot isn't dead. Just, you know, shoot them in the back, <laughs> hit them in the lung, and so that when the paramedics get there, he's just wheezing. <laughs> and um, you're like, I'm so sorry, cry. Don't forget to cry. You know, you better be a good actor if you're going to do something like this. Uh, <laughs> cry a lot, snot. You know, oh. snot always works coming down the nose because like, nobody like the wants. Like Blair Witch Project. Yeah, like the Blair Witch Project, and um, and then uh, you know, drive home in, in your own car where you got shot, <laughs> and um, don't tell nobody if you don't want to, or wait for it to become news on Facebook. <sighs> Can you tell she's upset? Well, I just couldn't believe it. When did it become legal to discharge a firearm, accidental or not, on public pro on public property, such as a city park? Oh. Well, you can't even con carry a concealed weapon out here, can you? Yeah. You can't? Yeah. Oh, God, that's scary. Yeah, we're just like Texas. Bunch of idiots walking around with guns. Yeah, you can bet your bottom dollar. Um, I am probably going to get through about four books this week. Or five. I hope four. Grandma will get through ten. Yeah, she always beats me. <laughs> She'll, we'll start the book at the same time. She'll be done in an hour. It take me like two days. Yeah. And um then we'll 
do it all over again. I'm going to put four of them here. So that's our story uh, for the week. And we're sticking to it. Yeah, I thought you guys might get a kick out of that. Tell me, what are your laws in your city? Uh, can people get away with doing that? Shoot somebody in the back uh, seat of a car and then call the police, start crying, and then not have to go to jail? Can, can that happen in your neighborhood? <laughs> if so, where do you live? <laughs> That's kind of weird. Where I live? New Mexico. That's that's what happened to me. It didn't happen to you. Yeah, it happened in my neighborhood right behind me. Right behind our house in the park. That's what makes it scary. I know. What makes it scarier is the fact that they got away with it. They got away with it and they let a 16-year-old girl who is a minor at 2 in the morning. Yes. Stay in the car and go home. With them. With them. Yeah. Are you kidding me? She wasn't related to neither one of them. No, I figured. Mm, mm, mm. Whew. So. She's getting off her soapbox now. I'm off my soapbox. <laughs> this is May 8th through the 14th. This was Cozy Sweets 1 and 2. Thank you so much, Victoria Thatcher, for making these wonderful stickers. I did print them out myself on sticker paper or on regular paper and then I ran them through my Xyron. Easy to do. And then I used my gyro cut to cut them out. And Even though I don't really do straight lines. And don't forget, I will be making my shop into a printable shop. I will be making my shop into a printable shop. And it's going to be printables. Coming soon. Coming soon. June the 4th. Yes. She's going to have a, a coupon for Manic Planner, folks, for the group Manic Planners on Facebook, for her grand reopening, or actually it's a grand opening of the printable shop. Yeah. So look forward to that, guys. And um, thank you so much for watching. We appreciate you guys. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Have a great one. Bye. Bye.